want macroeconomic certainty for us for 30 years, they cannot tell us what an important small policy measure will be in five years' time. In terms of the question about the BBC, of course you'll be able to watch the BBC. And on the final issue, which was banking, thrown in at the back of that question, and it's the one George ended with. Let me finish with this. The argument goes that if we maintain sterling, a foreign country will be controlling our economy. <laughs> what errant nonsense. The Bank of England has one target, it's a 2% inflation target. They do not set or work to growth targets, they do not set or work to inflation targets, uh, to, to, to uh, deficit targets, they do not set or work to debt targets. They have one target to reach, which is an inflation target. We accept the discipline imposed by an independent central bank, but we have all the fiscal levers at our disposal that George Osborne currently has that we in Scotland do not. But just think about it another way. Are they really to say Scotland can't continue to use sterling? The 40 billion receipts from oil and gas currently in sterling would be receipted in a foreign currency. That would double the UK trade deficit and shred sterling overnight. When we're independent, with £47 billion pounds worth of imports from England, we will be the rest of the UK's second largest export market after the United States. Are unionist politicians really going to run around every business in the rest of the UK saying we are going to put additional transaction costs on the best part of 50 billion worth of trade with all of the job losses that that implies just to score a political point in the run-up to a referendum. Sterling's our currency too. We contribute to it, we'll continue to co contribute to it. It works for both sides, which is why Alistair Darling actually said a currency union is sensible and desirable. And I'm certain when we get the heat of the referendum out of the way, that's precisely where we'll end up. Thank you very much for listening. I hope I've answered all the questions. Thank you very much.